And we are back. What's up, Hall of Famers? Card Shop Eric here, back live at Hall of Fame Baseball Cards in Arcadia, California, getting ready to execute our four box chrome mixer group break. By mixer, that means we mixed up a bunch of different products here. We got Panini Optic Box, we got Panini Prism, we got Topps Finest, and we got Topps Chrome. These are all some fine chrome products. This was only $20 a spot. If you missed out on getting into this break, we got a couple of good ones that are up right now, including the upcoming Bowman Sterling. Spots are going fast on that. And then the uh, second upcoming Topps Archives full case break. I'm going to drop a, a link into the group chat right now. I see people jumping into the group chat. I'll uh, say what's up to you guys in a minute. Beforehand, let me take care of some business for those who are participating. Thanks to everyone who jumped into this break. We appreciate your support. Let's do some team randomizations right here, right now, and see who we all get matched up. Follow along, won't you? All right, here we go. We got uh, the list of participants right here in the order they jumped in as usual. We're going to randomize that list by rolling the dice first. Dice comes up with a six. So we randomize this list six times. Here we go. That's one, two, three, four, five, and six. So there's the list of participants. Nicely randomized. Let me just quickly copy and paste that into the spreadsheet. There we go, participants. Now we need to match you up with your MLB teams. Here they are listed in alphabetical order as usual. I'm going to roll the dice one more time. <clears throat> dice still thinking. Ooh, came up with another six on that right there. You can see the timestamp changed right there. Perfect. Right on. Two sixes. Here we go, six more times. One. Two, three, four, five, and the final roll. There's six. Let me copy and paste this, and then you can check out the uh, official screen. There it is. There's the official matchups right there for this Chrome Mixer break. I always like to see who got the Dodgers. Justin J got matched up with the Dodgers. I believe he's a Dodgers fan. Uh, Christopher C. matched up with the Angels. Jeffrey R. matched up with the Mets. The Mets are a good team to have in these breaks. Uh, Eric L. matched up with the Blue Jays. Uh, let's see, Yankees are always a good team. Ryan N. got the Yankees, and you can see everything else right there. You can screenshot that real quick if you're participating. Uh, if you come in late, you can ask us. If we see your question, we can tell you which team you got matched up with. But for now, let's get back to the main screen and get into some tops or some panini. What do you guys want to see? I'm turning my attention towards the uh, YouTube viewers right now. What do you want to see first? Optic, Prism, Finest, or Chrome? Type it into the group chat right now while I take a little sip ski of my fake Mountain Dew soda. <sighs> Got a vote for Chrome, a vote for just tops, a vote for Prism. Few few votes for Prism. A lot of people saying Prism right now off the top. A little vote for Chrome. A couple votes for Finest. But I think the Prism votes are winning out right now. So we're going to kick it off by checking out some uh, Panini Prism with three autos per box. Bringing that one right to the forefront here. And now as I get into this first box, uh, let's talk about locations. We are located in Arcadia, California. But we'd like to know where you guys are located as you're watching. Type in your locations right now in the group chat. We'll do quick shout outs to a few people. Cam Vett, what's up, Cam in Santa Monica? We got Chandler in Charlottesville and Bubble Pug, what's up in Wisconsin? Arnold in Florida, Will in Georgia, and Luke in Illinois. We got Blake uh, saying finest still. We got uh, Dudacorns in Pennsylvania and Ryan in New York. and. What's up, Justin in Seattle, and Cooper in LA, and Dylan in Philadelphia, Christian in Oklahoma, Chad in Honolulu, James in Canada, Justin in Seattle, Justin in Sioux City, Gary in Ohio, Harrison in Alabama. We got a lot of people watching right now, 
And we appreciate you guys tuning in. Let's see what's up with Panini Prism right now. Tomorrow is what? Do you guys know what tomorrow is? Somebody, somebody type it into the chat. Tomorrow's a big day. What is tomorrow? Been announcing it. We've been talking about it on our Instagram and on our YouTube all week long. Let's see. Dylan says National Card Day. Cooper, National Baseball Card Day. Cam Vett, National Baseball Card Day. Chancellor, Chandler, Baseball Card Day. It is National Baseball Card Day. It's a day that actually tops created specifically for us to celebrate the hobby. And that is tomorrow. You should get down to your local participating hobby shop. If you don't have one, you can get products from us at hofbc.com, and we'll be giving out some free National Baseball Card Day packs if you purchase any 2019 Hobby Tops products tomorrow. You can also come down to the shop. We're located uh, just outside Los Angeles. We're going to be having events all day long. I'm telling you, it's going to be going crazy. We're going to be open 10 a.m. to 7 p.m. You get a free hot dog off the grill outside just for coming in. You get a free pack of cards just for coming in. The exclusive National Baseball Card Day packs. And then we got events all day long. Putt for packs, trivia, vintage card giveaways, uh, raffles. And we got a free box break going on. Uh, all sorts of fun stuff all day long. Ivan Arroyo will be there. Thanks for the super chat, Ivan. Thanks for telling everybody. So if you guys in L.A., you want to meet us, you want to meet Ivan, you come down to Hall of Fame tomorrow. It's going to be a blast. Here we go, folks. First pack. Trevor Williams. Rubel Herrera. Peralta. Strasburg. Suarez. Foley. Two low wicks, Witzky, blue parallel. Mookie Betts, insert. You got a nice little Pedro Martinez right here. That's kind of a psychedelic looking. Look at the background on that. It looks like someone took a uh, some kind of a grinder to some stainless steel. Anybody seen that effect before? That's pretty cool. Oh, and that card's numbered as well. 13 out of 35 right there. It's a nice old card. I'm going to sleeve that real quick. Going to Boston. Who's got Boston in this break? Brian L. It's the first little numbered card there. And rounding out that pack, we got uh, Salvador Perez, David Bodie, and Mr. Eric Hosmer right there. Uh, uh, uh. George Springer, Wisdom, Smith, Castellanos. I'm just going to look at the first few packs, then I'll start getting into the middle of the packs. Max Scherzer. We got a little red parallel of Kopech. We've got Blake Snell, a little scorching insert there. Ooh, we got a little Max Scherzer, Brilliance. That looks kind of gold and purple and pink and stuff. That's definitely cool. Wow. Number 10 of 10 right there. Max Scherzer. 10 of 10. Who's got the Nationals in this break? Let me look it up real quick. David S. David S. Nice little Max Scherzer gold parallel there. That's cool. Rounding out that pack, we got Yelich, Pence, and Daniel Murphy. Uh, 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 uh. Let's see. Pirates in this break belong to Richard P. Somebody was asking. I saw that. All right. Renfro on the front. Let's get to the middle of these, these packs now. See if we got any autos coming out. Kevin Mitchell. Anybody remember Kevin Mitchell from the Giants back in the 90s? He was cool. Uh, Nolan Arenado, stargazing insert right there. Miles Straw rounds out the uh, inserts on this pack. And that's number 394 out of 399 for Houston. Houston belongs to 
Christian P. Christian P. Cam Vet, or uh, sorry, Ivan with another super chat. What's up, Ivan? Looking forward to seeing you again tomorrow. He says, I would like to meet Cam Vet and everyone. I am excited. I'm going to wear my HOFB shirt. Thank you, Eric. Yeah, man. Come wearing your gear. Hopefully Cam Vet makes it out on Saturday. Anyone else tomorrow, come on down. Introduce yourselves. If you know us from YouTube, be sure to introduce yourself so we can put a face to the name. And be sure to check the uh, blog post on our website, too, for the schedule of events. We got a free box break to the first 30 participants. We're going to have a raffle. Raffling up three boxes of cards. Tops Allen and Ginter. Uh, Tops Chrome and uh, something else. Tops Heritage, I think. Uh, let's see. Middle of this pack. Looks like it holds an autograph. I'm going to save that for a minute. We're going to look at the uh, colored parallels here. Jake Bowers. Luis Severino and Manny Machado right there. That one's numbered. I'm going to sleeve that in a second. But this should be an autograph behind Mike Miner. Let's see who it is. Oh, my gosh. Eloy Jimenez is the first auto to come out in Prism. We know that's a pretty desirable name right now. Eloy Jimenez, Chicago White Sox. Pretty clean-looking signature. Who got the socks in this break? All the way at the bottom. That's Rio H. Boom Machine Activated, says Cam Vet, right off of the first hit. Rio H, you should be excited about that. You're going to receive this rookie auto from one of the uh, more desirable rookies in the season this year, Eloy Jimenez with the Chicago White Sox right there. That's pretty nice. Sick. I'll stand him up in the back just for now. He can preside over in the corner there. There we go. Okay. I'll sleeve up this Manny Machado for the Baltimore Orioles owner, which is uh, Jason C. gets that card. Sick. So starting it off pretty well here with a nice Eloy rookie auto. That's cool. Three autos per box. JB93 says, Shop, did you hear about the Yankees and White Sox next season? Playing at Field of Dreams. Yes. Of course I heard about that. That's amazing. Uh, I wish it would be nice to be one of the uh, one of the 8,000 ticket holders that get to uh, watch that game. I'm slim chance that I'll get to be one of them, but I would love the opportunity if anybody from MLB happens to hear about this message right now from deep space. Please hook me up with a ticket somehow. There's Chris Sale. Field of Dreams, one of my favorite baseball movies of all time. Brings me to a good question. Let's talk about that. Type in the chat right now, you guys. What's your favorite baseball movie of all time? Type it in right now. I want to see what comes up as we check out this Anthony Rizzo, Soda Pop Green. Numbered 43 of 199. Let's see. Peter Smith says Major League. We got the Sandlot. We got another Sandlot. JB93, I'm with you, man. The Natural is one of my favorite uh, baseball movies of all time. Ivan says A League of Their Own. Another vote for Sandlot by Chad. Another vote for Major League. Luke says Field of Dreams. Justin says Major League. Ch Chandler, a couple people just saying Mickey. I'm not sure what Mickey is. Is there a Mickey baseball movie that I don't know about? Rookie of the Year. Uh, Bull Durham. Bull Durham's a fun one. The Natural. What's up? What's up, King Petty 43 Thanks for the $2 super chat. I believe that's you, Richard. He says, Bad News Bears. That's a good one. Yeah. There's some great baseball movies. I feel like there's one that didn't get mentioned. Um... Major League was mentioned, Field of Dreams was mentioned, The Natural was mentioned, uh, Bad News Bears was mentioned, Sandlot was mentioned. Those are all good. I feel like there's one more. Bull Durham was mentioned. Rookie of the Year. Rookie of the Year was mentioned. Here's Yelich. Here's Carlos Rodon. League of Their Own was mentioned. That was good also as well. Here's Max Scherzer. 
And a little snakeskin parallel of Andrew Haney right there. That's nice. Number 23 out of 50. Uh, Kai Dizon mentions Moneyball. Angels in the outfield. Cooper mentions bench warmers. That's funny. For the love of the game. Oh, Tyler Brenner. Good one. How about 42? Absolutely. That movie should be up there. Looks to be uh, possibly another autograph in this pack here. Let's put the base cards aside. All cards do ship in our breaks. Sometimes we just don't show all the base cards because it takes so long. But here's some color. Shane Bieber. No relation to Justin Bieber, apparently. I always thought they were related. Uh, here's a Nick Williams little parallel right there. Let's check out the autograph. Behind No More Mazzaro, we got Chad Sobotka with Atlanta. So Atlanta picking up a little something here in the break early. It's only the second hit. Atlanta in this in this break belongs to Christopher C. So Christopher C, you got yourself a blue parallel rookie autograph from Chad Sabatka, Atlanta Brave. And then we got this uh, Nick Williams card right here going to Philadelphia. Justin J gets this card, and hey, you know what? We're gonna do the numbers game right here. Guess a number between 1 and 299. If you happen to guess that number exactly correct, we'll ship you a pack of Prism. Only one guess per person or you're immediately disqualified. You have 10 seconds to make your guess. Go. Bubble Pug first up with 143. Nine seconds left. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. All right, I always find a cutoff guess. Uh, cutoff is Luke Johnson with 184, and the number is 264. 264. Did anybody guess 264? I see a 245. Going back up into the break, 275 was pretty close by Devin Mata, but no 264. Thanks, Ivan, for helping me out there. Fun game to play, tough, tough game to win, but it is fun. We'll do that again before the break's over. All right, middle of this pack, we're showing a uh, Taylor Ward rookie card. Rowdy Tellez right there. Seen plenty of him coming out this season. Christian Yelich and Ryan Meisinger. A little, some kind of a, wow, a little prism. That's super prismed out right there, a little... Checkerboard prism is what I'm calling that now. 22 out of 75. St. Louis in this break is owned by Stephen S. There you go, Stephen. That one's for you. <clears throat> All right, next pack here we got Michael Kopech, blue. Nice looking card. Billy Hamilton insert. We've got Corbin Burns, of course. It wouldn't be a 2019 break without Corbin Burns. This should be numbered. Yeah, 244 out of 399. That's cool. Milwaukee belongs to Robert H. Three packs left in this box, then we move on. Middle of this pack, we find Max Scherzer. We find Bryce Harper, Lumber Inc. I like these inserts. These are nice looking inserts, especially with the Chrome technology. 
And then we got a little Soda Pop Gold here, the Colonel. The Colonel Perez coming out here on the Soda Pop Gold for Houston. I believe I shouted out Houston earlier. This is Christian P. And it's numbered 81 out of 150. All right, middle of this pack looks to be holding an autograph. This should be the final autograph. In fact, I'm going to save that for a minute. I'm going to save that stack. There it is sitting right there behind us. I'm going to open up this one first. Let's check out the middle of this pack first just because. Derek Rodriguez, San Francisco. We got a nice Walker Bueller, instant impact. Walker had a great game the other day with 15 Ks and zero walks. King Petty 43 with a $2 super chap. How do we get to see our teams again, Eric? Uh, I can tell you your teams. Just give me a moment here. Um, so let's see. Richard P. Uh, Caesar got uh, the Royals and the Mariners. Richard, you got the Rays and the Pirates. So not awesome, maybe. <clears throat> Uh, so behind Walker Bueller, we've got a, a little soda pop green, Roselle Herrera, right there. And we'll do another numbers game here. This is numbered out of 199. So pick a number between 1 and 199. If you get it exactly correct, we'll send you a pack of prison. Only one guess per person or you're immediately disqualified. You have 10 seconds to guess. Go now. Luke Johnson in first with 162. Nine seconds, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right, the cutoff is, uh, thanks Ivan for another super chat. Appreciate it. Alex wants to know how to join breaks. I'm going to paste the link into the chat. No, I'm not. That was the wrong link. Ivan, check out hofbc.com or, or Alex or whatever. Maybe Ivan, uh, if you have a minute, maybe you can help out and type and paste the link to our website, to our group breaks pages. Ivan, if you could do that, that'd be helpful. All right, cutoff is Ron Paxton with 128. The number is 40 out of 199. Let's see who guessed 40. Anybody guessed 40? We had a lot more time to guess there. Any 4-0? I'm not seeing it. Nobody with 4-0. I see Jason gets 48. Jason usually has a pretty good guess. Nice try, everybody. And the final pack, which was sitting here because it has an autograph in it, the final autograph in this box. It also has uh, Matt Olson. That's upside down. Miguel Andahar. Chris Sale, which I will sleeve in just a moment. And the autograph is C.D. Pelham. He sounds like an old, like, novelist or something. Hey, guys, my name's C.D. Pelham, huh? Yeah, check out my new novel. Texas getting this one. Texas belongs to Justin J. There you go, Justin. A little autograph for you, buddy. And that rounds out the box of prism. We're going to do finest next because it's sitting right here in front of us. We're going to go finest next. And then after finest, we got optic and chrome back there just looming. Booyah. <sighs> Here's Top's Finest. I'm a little short-staffed here at the shop today, so I can't do as much posting links into the group chat and things like that today, unfortunately. But if you need to jump into any of our breaks or get products from us, just visit us online at halloffamebaseballcards.com. We also have all the uh, National Baseball Card Day info up there as well. All right, top's finest. I'm just going to rip into both of these mini boxes.
All right. King Petty 43 with another $2 super chat. Thanks, buddy. He says, come on, Wander autograph. So you want the Wander Franco, huh? Gregory Polanco, Blackman, Pujols, Hader, and Peralta in the first pack. I'm just going to do this first stack. Here, somebody pick a pack for me. One, two, three, four, or five. Where's the autograph going to be found? <clears throat> Looks like Ivan was able to paste the link to our uh, website. You can click that link if you want. Cam Vett says pack two. Joshua says pack four. So we'll start with those two, see if either one of those guys are right. Jose Ramirez here. Oh, it might be an auto it might be an autograph behind Granky. I feel like it is. We got Nola, we got Vado, and I think this is an autograph. It looks like there's some there's some space to sign down there, right? A little white space there. We got an Orioles. Cedric Mullins. It wouldn't be a tops break without a Cedric Mullins rookie auto. But the owner of the Baltimore Orioles loves this, and that is Jason C. Jason C. It's pretty clean on card autograph right there. He's got a little Roman numeral two, it looks like. Is he a uh, Cedric Mullins the second or something? I wonder. But uh, there you go. Jason C. Let's see what's in pack four. I think there's only one autograph per mini box. But hopefully there's some color. Rosario, blue chips, insert, Lindor, and Bellinger. Bellinger's having quite the season, isn't he not? Is he not? That guy can do no wrong right now. Hopefully he stays cool. Byron Buxton, Aaron Judge, Austin Meadows. Ooh, a little blue parallel Lucas Giolito right here. That's nice. Wasn't expecting that. 75 out of 150, so the White Sox getting some more love. I believe that's Rio H. 75 out of 150. Nice little blue parallel. Thanks to Prune for the $1 Super Chat. He just wanted to make a quick donation. No comment or nothing, but we thank you for the quick donation, and thanks for being here and watching our channel. Anybody just popping in right now, uh, make sure, uh, please subscribe to our channel, by the way, if you're not for some reason already. And also uh, hit that like button on this video right now. We like to see how many likes we can get during the live stream. I'm going to do the same right now. Just a little personal challenge. Just something for fun, I don't know. Watch numbers grow and whatnot. Here we got Justice Sheffield, uh, Jacob deGrom, Kluber, Prize performers and uh, Acuna Jr. and DJ Stewart. Somebody pick a number one through six and try to predict the autograph in this little stack right here. Cam Vett says three. The third bird says one. So we'll do three, one, and then we'll see uh, JT Casting says four. So that's going to be one, two. I think that's that one. J.D. Martinez, Crawford. Oh, I think there's a blue auto right here. Posey, Kershaw. Behind Brandon Crawford, I think it's an auto. It looks like St. Louis, and it's going to be Jose Martinez, a blue parallel auto. So St. Louis getting a little love. Who got St. Louis in this break? Stephen S. Stephen S., this card's numbered 144 out of 150. It's a nice Jose Martinez on card autograph it looks like he kind of it looks like he kind of tried to sign and then re-signed almost like maybe the first marker ran out of ink or something that's a little, a little strange but uh, still a cool card blue parallel love it wow do we have another autograph in here did we get a bonus? Mikel Franco, Scooter Janet. We might have gotten a bonus right here. 
We, oh, I saw the white down there and it threw me off. No bonus. My bad. Louis Urias, little, little finest first rookie. Yippee Kaye. Chris Davis, Estudio, Carlos Correa, Christian Yelich, Shohei Otani. Should be all the autographs left in these packs, but you never know. Adonis, Arenado, Blake Snell, Kepler, and Anderson. Kyle Tucker, Rizzo, Acuna, Blue Chips, Danny Jansen, and Urias again. And then rounding out this box of finest, last pack of finest, we got D. Gordon rounding it out. Hosmer helping to round it out. Uh, Goldie. Chance Adams rookie and Ramon Laureano rookie. And that'll do it for Top's Finest. Up next, we're going to get into Panini Optic. Why not? We did Panini Prism, then we did Top's. Now we're doing Panini, then we'll end with Top's. So that's fine. Give me a second to take a sip of my citrus drop. Alrighty. Panini Optic. Maybe we'll get a hot box. You never know. Hopefully we do. Isaac says, hola. Regards from Tijuana, Mexico. Hola, Isaac. Como estas? You're not too far away. Come visit sometime if you have the means, though I know it could be difficult. That's all I'm going to say about that, but we appreciate you tuning in from Tijuana. Muy bien, gracias. Y tú? Muy bien. Excited that it's Friday. All right, let's get into uh, optic here. Trey Mancini, Whit Merrifield, we got uh, Paul Goldschmidt, Taylor Ward, rounding out pack number one here. Jesus Aguilar, we got a little neon parallel of Ramon Laureano, Shohei Otani highlights card there as well, and Jake Bowers. Hey, numbered card challenge with Ramon Laureano rated rookie. This card's numbered out of 199. Pick a number between 1 and 199. If you get the number exactly correct, we'll ship you a pack of optic. Only one guess per person or you're immediately disqualified. You have 10 seconds to guess. Starting now, James Gonzalez first up with 22. 9 seconds. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, one. All right, the cutoff is uh, Rick's Metalworks. Actually, Tyler Brenner made it with 127. Uh, the, the number is 34. Ivan, did anybody get 34? Anybody guess 34? Ooh, Christian Potts said 33. I see a 37. I see a 35. I see a 36. Oh, my gosh. We were all around it. Oh, man, we had that hole surrounded like a foursome on a par three golf course. Was that a, was that a good analogy? <laughs> All right, thank you. I thought that was pretty nice. Nice try, everybody. That was so close, man. <laughs> Cam Vett liked my analogy. Eugenio Suarez, Justin Verlander. Fernando Tatis Jr., peak performers insert. These are nice little inserts. And Astudio. Still looking for our first auto out of Panini Optic Box. 
Blake Snell. Oh, we might have found it. I think it's behind Blake Snell. It's in front of Mookie Betts. It's in front of Steven Duggar. I think the autograph is behind Blake Snell. Let's see who it is. Oh, Eloy Jimenez. Maybe Vlad Jr. gave him a call and said, man, this place is great. You should start showing up. Today, Eloy Jimenez loves Hall of Fame baseball cards in Arcadia, California. Wow. And that is on card, baby. Rated rookie for Chicago White Sox. Rio H is ba da ba ba ba. Wow. You know Vladdy and Eloy probably talk. Vladdy was like, bro, you got to get on down to Hall of Fame, man. You got to show up. That's sick. That's not numbered. I was hoping it would be. Doesn't look to be numbered unless I'm missing it. No. But still cool. One of the neon inserts is what I'm calling them. And both Eloys now are going to be presiding in the background of the rest of this video right here. One there, one here, boom. Oh, yeah. Those are looking good right there. Look at that. All right. David Bodie, Herman Marquez, Shohei Otani, Action All-Stars. I wish one of these companies would bring back the uh, oh, Sport Flicks. Come on. Ivan Camvet, some of you guys might remember Sport Flicks cards. You remember those? I feel like Topps kind of almost sort of tried to bring them back with the uh, Stadium Club case hit cards. But not fully. Robert H. Rem remembers Sport Flicks. Tyler O'Neill. Jason says, I have stacks of those. <laughs> Probably not the only one. No Fear Fishing is asking, where is your shop at? Uh, we appreciate you checking in. Appreciate you watching our video. You must be new. Uh, somebody tell them where we're located. I feel like somebody in the group chat knows where we're located right now. Tyler O'Neill, Michael Conforto, Yusei Kikuchi, the rookies, and Aaron Judge right here. Cam Vett and Alex are correct. We are located in Arcadia, California. 91006. Felix Hernandez might have another autograph behind Felix. Yohan Moncada. John Duplantier. <laughs> Jackson says we're located in Area 51. Hey, here's Caleb Ferguson coming out of left field. Might as well came from Area 51. Haven't seen too many of his. He pulled here at least yet this season, I don't think. Caleb Ferguson, rated rookie. Number 28 out of 50. Looks like L.A. Dodgers right there. And who the Dodgers belong to? Justin J. I I guess that one's yours. Justin, if you're still in the chat, check that puppy out. That's a nice on-card autograph. <clears throat> Excuse me. And that's two autographs, and we've only gotten through not even half the box. Possibly a hot box? Possibly five autographs per box instead of the usual two? That was, that was our second autograph out of this box, I believe. Maybe we'll get three more. Joshua Ferguson says he's coming to our shop October 17th for his birthday. Well, we'll wait and see about that. I will believe it when I see it. As my grandfather used to say, I'm from Missouri, the show me state. Right here, I'm showing you a Michael Kopeck rated rookie and a Mike Trout MVP card. Jacob Degrom. We got Pete Alonzo, the rookies. There we go. Mets getting some love. Jeffrey R. Steven Gonzalez, rated rookie. And then we got a little another little neon here. Aaron Judge. A little neon all-stars. And this is like a Icy bluish green color. I'm not sure if it translates on the camera right now, but it's definitely cool in person. This going to the Yankees. Ryan N. Ooh, 
low number too. 22 out of 35, upper left corner. 22 out of 35. There you go, Ryan. Nice card, bud. <clears throat> Anthony Rendon, Miguel Andahar, Mookie Betts, and Jose Barrios. Well, we've already pulled two autographs out of this box, but we've only gone through half the box. I guess there's a chance there could be more. It could be a hot box. Scooter. Hosmer. Shohei Otani peak performers right there. That looks cool. And Framber Valdez, excuse me. Paul Goldschmidt, Jack Flaherty, Albert Pujols, and Bryce Harper. I would love to see a few more autographs come out of here. I would love it to be a hot box. Walker Bueller, Yelich, Joe Adele rated prospect, and Michael Perez rated rookie. That's a decent little pack of cards right there. I was pitching Walker Bueller in MLB The Show last night. Me and Yamo were playing side by side. And we, we decided to do Dodgers versus Red Sox at Fenway. He had never seen Fenway Park before, actually. And I started, Walker Bueller started. For some reason, Kershaw was not in the pitching lineup. Is anybody, can anyone explain that? Is there something going on with Kershaw that I don't know about or something? So I couldn't start Kershaw. I wanted to. He started Chris Sale, I think, right? And Bueller stunk it up for me. I don't know if it was me just not locating the pictures, but I had to pull him at the uh, after two innings. <laughs> Here's a uh, Votto, Bellinger, Scherzer, and Chapman. Here's Otani, Cano, Chavez, Hernandez. Well, I'm guessing there's not three more autographs in this box. We just happened to find both autographs on the same side of the box, which made it seem like we might be getting more. Perez, Syndergaard, Scherzer again, and Scherzer again. Wow, that's three Scherzers in two packs in a row. Albert Pujols, we've got, wow, some kind of a gold card coming up. I'm going to hold on to that for a second. Charlie Blackman, Reese McGuire rated rookie, and let's see who's behind Pujols here. Optic cards look great in gold. Oh, it's a gold All-Stars All -Stars, Bryce Harper. Gold All-Stars Bryce Harper. Uh, how much are, um, <clears throat> Philadelphia Phillies are owned by Justin J. Justin, this is your card, and it's numbered. There it is, upper left, 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10 right there. So, Justin, there you go, buddy. <clears throat> Lindor, Moustakas, Seeger. Tatis Jr., rated rookie. Two packs left in this, and then we move on to the box of tops chrome. Freddie Freeman, Jose Barrios, Pujols, Luis Urias. Edwin Encarnacion, Yadier Molina. Danny Jansen and Javier Baez round out the last pack of Optic. Coming up next, Topps Chrome Box. One moment, please. King Petty again with the $5 Super Chat. Thanks, Richard. 
He says, a chrome wander would look good next to my Garrett, Garrett Hampson. I bet it would. I would love to pull something magical for you. Let's see what's up. Let's just get right into it. Why not, right? Here we go. Supposed to be two autos per box here. Somebody pick a stack for me. One, two, three, or four, and I'll start with that stack. Cowboy Toto says, just bought a slot for the Bowman Sterling group break. Thanks very much. Let me see if I can quickly copy, paste. I just dropped a link to our group breaks page. You guys can click on that. By the way, who was the first to comment? I was busy there trying to drop a little link. Cam Vet, of course, with two. We'll start with that stack. Ivan with the $2 super chat. You know who, who loves coming to HOFBC? Well, let's see. Let's see. We only got two autos per box here. This was just a little uh, little kind of an inexpensive break for people that wanted to try us out. We just put together. This was just 20 bucks a spot, free shipping, just to try us out. Arcia, Fam, Bowers, and Molina. Have you guys seen the design for the uh, 2020 tops design yet? Believe it or not, we just had to place our hobby shop order for 2020 tops series one today. How many months ahead of time? That's like six months ahead of time. Have you seen the new design? If yes, what do you think about it? Later, Cam. Come on out tomorrow, buddy. Devin Mata says, looks cool. Alex35 says, it's nice. I always try to picture the Topps designs in chrome style. Because I think that's the test. If it looks good in chrome, it's cool. If it doesn't look good in chrome, it's not going to look good anywhere. That's me. Oh, we got angels right here. Who do we got? Oh, David Fletcher. Man, I really got excited for a minute. He used the uh, thick tip pen. Uh, angels in this break, by the way, are owned by <clears throat> Christopher C. So there you go, Christopher. One of the two autos in this box is yours. Taylor Ward, Acuna. Schwarber and Blue Peril, blah, 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 blah. You guys know who this is. Miguel Andahar. Yankees belong to Ryan N. And this card's numbered out of 150, and I like this card, so we're going to do the numbered card challenge. Pick a number between 1 and 150. If you get the number exactly correct, we'll ship you a pack of Topps Chrome. Only one guess per person or you're immediately disqualified. You have 10 seconds to guess. Go. Luke, first on the button with 129. Nine seconds. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Was anybody watching? Does anybody know what that was from? That was a super obscure move from one of my favorite movies. In three, two. 
Anyways, last guess goes to David with 64. The number is 50 out of 150. Certainly somebody had to say 5-0. Wow, I see 56s. I see 55s. I don't see any 5-0s. Nobody guessed a straight 50. Fun game to play, hard game to win. By the way, my, my little obscure little movie thing was from Wayne's World. Anybody remembers Wayne's World? Reese Hoskins. We're looking down on Wayne's basement, only that's not Wayne's basement. Vlad Guerrero Jr. rookie card. Garth, that was a haiku. <laughs> uh, all right, continuing on, we're going to go with this stack right here. Avila, Tatis Jr., little horizontal rookie. Peralta, Barucki. Wouldn't be a break without Barucki. I'm going to put that on a t shirt. Yeah, Wento, I was hoping you'd chime in. I figured you might know that. Super obscure, though. Freddie Freeman, Devers, Mullins, and Soto. Vato, Sale. We got some kind of orange back there behind Sale and in front of Dahl. Maybe it's signed. It says L.A. at the top. Who do we think it is? Let's see. Oh, that looks like, that looks like, that looks like Cody. That's Cody's face, isn't it? Is that Cody's face? No. I can't tell. Because of the puffed up cheeks, I can't tell. Anybody see? Is that Ballinger? It's got to be, right? It is. I was hoping that would be autographed, but a nice orange parallel, Cody Ballinger. Get a sleeve on that real fast. Picture is kind of interesting with his cheeks all puffed up right there. Threw me off for a second, but uh, Dodgers, Justin J gets this card. It's numbered one out of 25. That's pretty sick right there, Justin J. That card is all you, boo. Sick. Stephen Piscotti. Oh, and there's the second autograph with no warning right there. Chris Shaw, another, another name we've been seeing a lot of from the products this season. Chris Shaw, on-card rookie autograph, going to the owner of the San Francisco Giants, which is in the number one spot, Rio. Rio H landed the Giants in the number one spot and then landed the White Sox in the number 30 spot. There you go. Got to be loving that. There you go, Rio H. Her name is Rio and she dances on the sand. Jake Bowers. Marte Castellanos. Yes, Isaac. That was Duran Duran. Nice pull. Panic, Knicks, Rogers, and Granky here. Just uh, about a half a box left of Topps Chrome here. Sanchez, Stewart, Fellmeyer, and Richards. Lorenzo Cain, Chris Davis, Rizzo, Margot. Garcia, Hendricks, Kepler, and Bellinger again. It's the same image they use for that orange parallel card right there.
Jesse Winker, Carlos Correa, Michael Kopech, freshman flash rookie. I think these cards look real nice. Josh Bell. Glaber Torres, Sanchez, Pujols, and Odor. Baez, Alon, uh, Yonder Alonso, Chance Adams, little prism rookie right there, and Alex Bregman. Jamison Tyone, Hunter Renfro, Brandon Lowe, and Francisco Lindor. Shohei Otani, Mitch Hanager, Glaber Torres, and Brad Keller. Anthony Rizzo, Joey Rickard, Edwin Encarnacion, Raisel Iglesias. Three packs left, folks. National Baseball Card Day is tomorrow. If you're anywhere near Los Angeles, Come pay us a visit. It will be worth your while. It's a great day to interact with other collectors, which is probably the best part about it. Plus, we're doing raffles. We're doing giveaways. We're doing trivia and prize wheel spins. We got a ton of grab bags made. Yama's been working hard on grab bags. We're going to have hot dogs grilling up outside. You can get a free hot dog if you come by. That is tomorrow. It's going to be going off. We'll be open at 10 a.m. <clears throat> Free National Baseball Card Day packs while they last. We do have a good amount of those packs. But you never know. Last year we had over 200 people come through our shop on National Baseball Card Day. Over two, We gave away over 200 of those packs last year. So if you want to get your National Baseball Card Day free pack, make sure you show up early. You make purchases. You can get in a free box break. You can uh, be a part of our raffle. You can try to putt for packs. You can try some trivia for packs. You can try box folding contests for packs. Vintage card challenge for vintage tops cards. It's going to be sick. Thanks, Ivan, for dropping the address. Ivan Arroyo just dropped the address into the group chat. I'm also going to drop the link to our Group Breaks page on our website. And from there, you can navigate the website to our blog post and then find all the information on National Baseball Card Day festivities. And here's your hit recap from this Chrome Mixer, brought to you by us, Hall of Fame Baseball Cards, Arcadia, California, where it's always a beautiful day for collecting. Chris Shaw, David Fletcher, Angels. Caleb Ferguson coming out of Optic with uh, Dodgers. Jose Martinez from Finest. Mullins from Finest. C.D. Pelham and Chad Sobotka from uh, Prism. And then the two hits. Vladdy must have called his boy Eli, Eloy and told him to show up. Because Eloy showed up from Panini Prism on the left and Panini Optic on the right. Those were probably the most desirable hits that came out of this quick little four-box mixer. If you missed out on this break, jump into our next one at hofbc.com. And other than that, we will see you tomorrow, Saturday, National Baseball Card Day, right here at Hall of Fame Baseball Cards, Arcadia, California. If we don't see you tomorrow, we'll see you right here on Monday night for personal breaks. Wherever you are, enjoy National Baseball Card Day tomorrow and keep enjoying collecting. Have a great weekend, everybody, and we will see you tomorrow, National Baseball Card Day, right here, Hall of Fame Baseball Cards, Arcadia, California. Have a great rest of the day. Peace.